Invercargill has a growing teenage scene. We've got Blind Image, which is a program on Radio South and Access Radio, and also we've got a lot of young bands who are now starting to write their own thing. Well, on Friday, the two elements were combined together. There was a radio marathon, went for several hours, and included in that was part of a live concert from the Otapuni Gardens. Radio South 196.4 FM, that is Creed, and what's this live for? At 6 past 5 on this fantastic Friday afternoon. Now I know that all you people in the central city, you can hear our signal because we are booming in the booking place at the moment. Well, if you're just sitting there on your butt thinking, there's nothing to do. Well then please head on down right now to the Out of Uni Gardens where we are having our free live concert. This is Radio South 196.4 FM. 3, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay. Normally in the studio it's just us three, Blind Image, Anna Debbie and Dave, and um, today it's in front of a live audience, which is a bit different, and yeah, people, you don't actually have to look at anyone, talk to anyone on radio, so it's a bit harder, but it should be good, it should be a change. Okay, Anna, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, Q. This whole thing's organised for Radio South by 96.4. This is the start, kicking off a marathon. It's running for 14 hours from 5.30 to 7.30 tomorrow morning. Um, the aim of it is to show off Teenage Radio, basically. We've got a heap of shows on Radio Southland. <laughs> We do two separate mixes. Each microphone gets split two ways. Um, David's doing the PA mix, and then the microphone's split over to my side over here to the broadcast. If you look at it that uh, way, you've got a guitar. The guitar's up on the stage, and it's putting out X amount of volume, uh, so that the people here can actually hear the guitar on the stage. So David might just have to lift it up a bit, add 40% to it. But people at home, if we just gave them 40% of that in the mix, it would sound lousy, so we have to give them a different mix. <laughs> Yeah, I've listened to it a couple of times, I think. I don't really know what it is, you know. All they need to do to get everyone involved in it, you think? Oh, like advertise and stuff. Have big yeah, events that everyone comes to and then they find out that's... that big a crowd it's a wee bit disappointing but um, then again it's only been advertised on radio hasn't it and when you're doing it if they don't listen to that station then they don't know it's happening having the awareness of the marathon and everything is hopefully going to get more people listening so we more this sort of thing will be more successful in the future <laughs> There we have it, the concert at Oda Puny Gardens. It was part of a 13 hour long marathon on South and Radio, the access uh, program with Blind Image. And a lot of things happening. There's that Blind Image program, there's the Engage program, there's, there's local bands doing their stuff. You just feel that it all just has to come together and involve everyone down here in the South. And with that promise of a youth venue not too far away, maybe that will be the explosion that will set things up nicely. Okay, next we need to look at things through the eyes of each other. Maori and Pakeha need to see things differently. We have Raheli Bennett in next.